What's going on, squad? And welcome back to the Bone Bones Room. Today, I wanted to share my thoughts on why I think having a home theater is better than going to your local cinemas. Ray. Yeah. What's the name of that there nightclub of yours again? You talking about the Boom Boom Room? Yeah, the Boom Boom Room. That's it. So I'm gonna run down this list of why I think having your own home theater room is better than going to your movie theater. Now, these are not gonna be in any particular order. I'm not arranging them. I got 10 reasons, but I'm not gonna put them in which order is the best and worst. These are just 10 reasons that I came up for why I think it's better to have your own movie theater in your own house than going out to the theater. All right. So my first reason is your sound quality. Your sound quality in your home theater room is always gonna be much better than it is at the theater, at the movie theater. Because for number one, a movie theater, when they play their audio, for me, I know in my experiences at the movie theater, it's hard to hear uh, the surround effect because they have everything dialed up to 100. So everything is like the same level and it's like a just a loud, a loud noise. It's hard to differentiate something coming from the right, something coming from behind you. It's just something going panning to the left. It's just, to me, it just sounds all one level. And um, you you not going to get the same effect that you're going to have at, at, in your own house with your sound absorbent materials. Um, and with your surround sound. Now I have a Dolby Atmos 7.2.4 surround sound, so I get to experience the whole full effect of what some of these movies were recorded and designed to sound like by uh, the director. Um, the next thing I have, my next reason is you don't have the noise from the audience. How many times y'all been in the movies and something happened in the movie and everybody's laughing and then you might miss the next punchline? It's all because everybody's just so loud and sometimes you don't get certain parts of the movie until you actually get the movie home and get to watch it again on your own. So I think it's better to have to be in the piece of your own home and not have that crowd noise, or you don't have somebody sliding down the aisle saying, excuse me, can you, can they get past you? Um, or somebody talking too much in the movies, or little kids might be laughing, or anything like that. So that's the second advantage to having your own home theater than going out. All right. The next uh, reason I have is you get to eat your own food. Whatever you make upstairs or in your kitchen, you can bring it down to your to your uh, theater room and eat it. And if you have uh, some theater room chairs come with these uh, these tables that you can slide right on in here. Eat you a whole meal right here while you watching the movie to your liking. So, I mean, you can have your popcorn, your standard stuff, or you can have your dinner. <laughs> whatever you, whatever you choose, you can have it. So, that's the next reason. All right, my next reason is you get to drink whatever you want to drink. And I know some of the agents have, uh, they do serve alcohol, but when you're in your own home, you can have any kind of alcohol you want and as much alcohol as you want. You can have Slurpees, you can have water, you can have soda, and you can have alcohol. So that's another advantage to having your own home theater. All right, the next reason that I have 
for building your own home theater or having your theater in your own house is it's in the comfort of your own home. I can't tell y'all how many times I've been in my movie theater room and watching the movie and dozed off and fell asleep. And you, know, you don't have to worry about some stewardess coming in and telling you, excuse me, sir, the movie's over, you, you need to leave, and you mad that you done spent your money on the movie ticket, and you ain't even get to see the movie. Um, or you might even feel like coming in the theater room on the late night and just stand up, putting the all night and just binge watching movies until you fall asleep. And, uh, you know, just being able to recline in your own chairs in the comfort of your own home, you can't beat that. Then my next reason is the seats are much, much better. I love these theater seats. These are, uh, I got these seats from uh, Four Seating, company called Four Seating. And these are the Granadas and they, they recline. So I can lay back to the point where I feel like I'm, I'm laying in the bed. So that's another advantage. And these seats are hard. It, it's always hard for me to make it through a whole movie without dozing off especially when I got to see the movie. And nine times out of 10, when we watch a movie in the head, we were playing the seat. So that's another advantage. And you, like I said, you don't have to worry about somebody scooting past you trying to get to their seat. Um, yeah, it's just better, it's better. Um, well, my next reason is, if you start a movie, and you change your mind mid movie and you like, man, I ain't really feeling this movie. Let me put something else on. It's, it's my remote over there, but it's just the click of a button for you to just switch the movie and put something else on. So it ain't like you spent your money on a ticket and you not feeling the movie and you kind of regretting it and you gotta sit through the movie anyway and just watch it. So, yeah, man. Having your own movie collection that you built, is, that's, a, that's another advantage. My next reason is, it's good for bonding time with your family. So, this, me and my family, we had movie night. And, I mean, I get my wife, this her seat right here. My kids, they, they pick their own seats in the back. and. Um, yeah, we just get together. Everybody usually got their own blanket and they snuggled up on, on the seats. And we watching a good family movie or a comedy movie or a horror movie. And um, yeah, you just get to laugh and hey, have a good time with your family. I mean, you ain't gotta worry about your family out in the street. Everybody's home safe and y'all together. And you, you get to church these moments. I mean. Time is one thing that you, you don't get back. So I know my, my kids, they won't be kids forever. So while they kids now, kind of I kind of cherish these movies. So right now they, they young and they at, a, at an age where, um, you know, they not at that teenage age where they want to be out with their friends and stuff. So I know that time is coming. So I'm trying to enjoy this window now. Yeah, man, it's good for bonding with your family. My next reason is your theater room is customized to your liking. So hopefully everybody out there, if you have a theater room or you plan on building a theater room, that you get to design it the way that you want it and not being it's already made for you, and, and you just taking something somebody passed down to you. So, um, hopefully, I mean, and then another thing is that you uh, have to take your time building your theater room to make sure you get what you what you really want. So I wouldn't want to settle on something to hold me over. To, I know for me, when I was building my theater room, I um, I took my time and saved up my money to get what I really wanted. It was times where I could've took the cheap route out 
and just bought a cheap projector just to hold me over or some cheap speakers just to hold me over. So I, for me, I don't really like buying the same thing twice. So I just took my time and I said, you know what, however long it take me to save up the money to get the theater or equipment that I really want, that's what I'm gonna do because I, I didn't really want to have any regrets. So yeah, um, having your own theater customized to the way you, you wanted it or the way you envisioned it. And then just the sense of accomplishment after you built it, after you, you get to sit back and everything is done, you get to sit back and admire your creation and you like, I did, I did a pretty good job building this. Um, that's, that's a good feeling. So it's a feeling of accomplishment. Um, my next reason why I feel like having your own theater room is better than going to the movies is the picture quality is going to be better. Now, I know they have, for the majority of movie theaters, they are not in 4K, but if you have your own theater room, you got the ability to build you a 4K home theater room. Um, for me, I have a 4K screen, I have a 4K projector, and you put that with your 4K movies and you get a, a damn near perfect image. So, it's not a lot of movie theaters that are in 4K. Um, so, I don't really, I, I, I can't picture a movie theater having a better picture quality than what I have at home. I would, I would say that my theater, my projector, the picture quality comes close to, it's not, I ain't gonna say it's better than, but it comes very close to my OLED TV. I have an OLED TV and the picture quality that comes from my 4K projector is, uh, it's kinda sometimes hard to tell the difference. But um, yeah man, picture quality, so. If you're thinking about building your own home theater and you might be on the fence, of, uh, you know, should I do it, should I not? For me, it's, it's a no-brainer. I just gave you 10 reasons right there why having your own theater room. And one more thing, honorable mention, um, I don't even know if Theater rooms are ever going to be, I mean, movie theaters are ever really going to be back open the same as movie theaters, how we know them. With this COVID going around, um, I think the movie industry is uh, suffering right now. And I can't see people wanting to be crowded into a public place in, in a closed atmosphere and, you know, being okay with that. So, in the future, I see a lot of movies being released on demand. Um, I see now they thinking about putting Black Widow on demand, and uh, they just released Soul on demand, and Wonder Woman came out on demand. So, movie theaters just might be a thing of the past, as much as I hate to say it, unless they bring uh, re-established driving movie theaters and you know, the way things are these days, that ain't all that safe. But yeah, man, so those are my reasons of why I felt like having your own home theater is better than going to the movies. So let me run back down that list for y'all. So number one, I had sound quality is better. Number two, you get no crowd noise. Number three, you get to eat your own food. Number four, you get to drink your own drink. Number five, you in the comfort of your own home. Number six, you get to choose the most comfortable seats that's available to your budget, your price range. Number seven, having the ability to skip through movies, pick your movie, you know, you can go through multiple movies in a day, in a night. Um, Number eight is uh, good for bonding with your family. Number nine, your theater room is customized to your specific likings. 
Um, it can't get no better than that, in my opinion. And uh, number 10 is, I would say, picture partner. So keep those 10 things in mind when you're building your theater or just deciding if you want to do it or not. Um, I think it's a, a great investment. And I, it, it also adds value to your house. So just some things to think about. And I hope I was able to uh, give y'all some good information um, on, you know, thinking about building your own theater room and uh, if you like this video and you like this kind of content you don't mind hit that subscribe button and uh give me a thumbs up if you like the video and i just want to say i feel like i've been getting a lot of new subscribers and i wanted to say welcome to the family and to everybody else that's already been rolling with me I want to say I appreciate appreciate y'all for watching the videos, and um, I'm going to try keep bringing out more and more videos. So, thanks for watching my channel, and I'll catch y'all on the next one.